Sara Duterte, the daughter of outgoing Philippine President Rodrigo Duterte, took her oath as Vice President on Sunday in her southern hometown of Davao. In this city, Sara Duterte, also the outgoing mayor, comes two weeks before she assumes office on June the 30th as specified in the Philippine Constitution. I, I, Sara Zimmerman Duterte, do solemnly swear, do solemnly swear, that I will faithfully and conscientiously fulfill, that I will faithfully and conscientiously fulfill, my duties as Vice President of the Philippines, my duties as Vice President of the Philippines. So help me God. Congratulations and all the best, Madam Vice President. Like her father, Sara Duterte Carpio trained as a lawyer before entering politics in 2007 when she was voted in as her father's vice mayor in Davao, 1,000 kilometers away from the capital Manila. Her family, hailing from the modest middle class background, built a formidable political dynasty in the restive southern region long troubled by communist and Muslim insurgencies and violent political rivalries. During her speech, 15th Vice President called for national unity and devotion to God and asked Filipinos to the patriotism of the country's national hero, Jose Rizal. Hindi ako ang pinakamagaling o pinakamatalinong tao sa Pilipinas at sa mundo. Ngunit walang makakatalo sa tibay ng puso ko bilang isang Pilipino. Her running mate Ferdinand Marcos Jr., the son and namesake of the disgraced dictator driven from power in 1986 uprising, also took part in the inauguration ceremony attended by Duterte Caprio's relatives, allies, and supporters. Marcos Jr., who also won in the May 9th election, will be sworn in as the country's president on June 30th when their six-year term begins.